Hello, it's Judy Elliott here in the March of the Titanosaurs exhibition building, surrounded by, yet again, lots of rocks. Um, we're in the middle section here, and if you know anything about um, when a creek dries up and then it's in the sun and the sun shrinks all the dirt and you get all of these cracks and everything in it, that's what we can see here. It's, and, and that's what we saw and we were pulling our hair out wondering how on earth are we going to move this? It just looks as though it's going to fall to pieces. It's really scary, but thankfully, by the time we got to this section, there I had, there was three of us mainly doing the work, and that was myself, Anna and Chris. And every day we would come out and we would load up the trailer with rocks, some little rocks. Chris was amazing putting little jigsaws together and then some humongously big rocks. Anna was really good on a crowbar. And so we had to work out where all of these pieces went and gradually pick them up and put them onto the trailer. But we had to know how to put them back together again. And so we each had our textures and pens and we would put graf fossil graffiti is what we called it. So the side, the two sides, the two joining faces, we would put the same fossil graffiti on one face as the other. And then when we offloaded, we would know that those two pictures went together. Unfortunately, in the middle of doing all of this, it rained and we didn't get back to the site for, it was weeks and weeks and weeks. And because the whole trackway was in the bottom of the creek, it took some of our rocks with it. And unfortunately, there is a poor little face down here that has lost its partner because its partner got lost down the creek in the flood. So, yeah, it was a very sad ending for his partner, but we managed to get everything else. So we were very, very happy with it in the end.